We started this challenge with three simple rules. One, start with nothing. Two, no use of money. And three, ask only for stuff that was going to be thrown away. With the goals of gathering everything we need to survive and to travel from Oslo, Norway to Sweden. We wanted to experiment with what we really need to survive and more importantly to be happy. To experience true freedom and to see if people would be willing to share their access with others. I'm 22 years old and I have no idea how to do this. We forgot the knowledge that our previous generations have. Tum, 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 tum. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> We are ready to go back to civilization! Yes. Yeah. And we all got our own special style of yeah, we all clothes have now. Like, I've got the grass style, you've got the maple style. I really like it. You Canada. All kinds of stuff. <laughs> it's so nice, the feeling of just not having to carry anything, being able to wander around, having everything you need, and no plans. Except for trying to uh, survive. survive the yeah. night. <laughs> trying to survive, that's the plan, yeah. <laughs> yeah okay. Yeah, they're gonna answer the <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah, Thank you. Okay. Lovely. We started in the forest okay. with nothing, and then we just yeah. made some clothes with leaves. Das Wasser, some skekastes. I cannot see anything. <laughs> I couldn't see it. I was like, Whoa. he's not wearing his contacts. <laughs> I couldn't see him anywhere over there. <laughs> no, no. Vi har startet øh, i dag ude i skogen, ja. helt øh, nærkende. Okay. <laughs> og jeg har ikke været på jobb, og nu skal jeg egentlig fikse denne bil. Det er revolution fra vores. Veldig hyggelig. Ja, det er hyggelig. Ja, det er hyggelig. Tusind tak hyggelig, hyggelig. for øh, ja. turen. Vi har hitchhiked med en meget nice guy. Vi har hitchhiked sådan her. Og så gik vi ind i en butik, og de gav os rigtig gode nice sausages, nogle nice gode chips, og... Loads of fair trade organic mm, chocolate. And then we also got from a, a bakery two sandwiches. Yeah. He wanted to contribute to uh, to our journey. Hey, water! <laughs> Rice! And Rice! Water. Oh, oh, chips! Water. Now we just have to face the main challenge of the day, which is to find a warm and maybe not comfortable, but just a warm place to, to spend the night because so far we are still barefooted. I have some plastic around me, some leaves, and just a shirt. And it's gonna be around three degrees in the night. We have to figure out something pretty soon. <laughs> hey, uh, we are um, på et lille eksperiment. In fact, på butikken var sådan, hey, kan vi få et billede med jer? Ja. <laughs> det var også veldig fint, at det har lavet, faktisk. Vi har også en idé. Jeg klæder over ingen af det. At det er ulovligt at være nakken. Vi bliver født nakne, og så er det ulovligt. Altså, what the fuck? Det er en veldig god følelse, bare ligesom ikke at have noget at bære, og ikke at have noget klær, og bare være fuldstændig fri, og så We got the bed, got blankets, full stomachs. Couldn't be better. No, it's crazy. What you can accomplish in one day. At least if it starts raining, we're dry. Yeah. We gotta go look for some. Drinking water. Yeah, knocked on two houses and got two blankets. Nice. And one from each house that Great. they were not using. Great work.
But yeah, the people were really positive. So. Yeah, like pretty much everyone has been positive. <laughs> yeah. I think we look just strange enough for people to find it interesting. <laughs> yeah, like the other guy, the English guy, who was like, maybe you should take a shower in, in the lake. I was like, whoa, why am I that dirty? <laughs> <laughs> And then I asked another house and I asked for clothes. He wanted to donate some beer. Woo! And he was like, oh yeah, two seconds. And he comes back with a beer and this. <laughs> He's like, the beer will keep you warm. Yeah. yeah. Uh, yesterday morning we had nothing. Yeah. And now we have all of this. Yeah. We have arrived. Sveria. Sveria. We did it! We did it! We almost gave up hitchhiking today because it was taking a really long time to be picked up. And then a guy stopped. Yeah. And now we're at this beautiful lake. Sunset time. Sunset. It's pretty incredible knowledge to have or safety to have. To know that you are able to create and to establish everything you need from nothing quite fast with the help of others. This trip has really taught me how evident it is that we humans are here to help each other have the mm. best possible life. We, we, can, we can learn so much from each other, we can inspire each other in so many different ways. And Thank you, Sweden! <laughs> the best and the cheapest shower you'll ever get!